Hey, Claude Pallon here, Affiliate Starting Line. Welcome. This is a continuation of the Google Search Engine Optimization Starter Guide. And uh, this one is going to be about mobile sites. Now, here's an interesting thing about the guide. It goes through a lot of different subject matter that you would associate with SEO. And then it come, you come across this section here, Notify Google of Mobile Sites. The reason this is interesting is that, obviously, mobile marketing is now a big deal, or at least is on the radar, and is considered very important by Google. So what do they mean? Well, they mean to configure mobile sites so that they can be in indexed accurately. So, and it tells you, you know, it seems the whole world is going mobile. Many people are using mobile phones on a daily basis, and... Uh, they're using Google's mobile search page. So, you know, as an owner of a site, mo mobile sites not only use a different format than the normal desktop sites, but the management methods and expertise required are also quite different. So they're t saying you should make your websites mobile friendly. And uh, so how do you do that? Well, they tell you to do a few things here. One is verify that your mobile site is indexed by Google. So you want to make sure that you, and basically what they're saying here is Google bot, and that is the Google, Google mobile bot. There is Google bot for your regular website, and then there's Google mobile bot for your mobile website. Uh, and in order for you to get the data about what's going on with a Google mobile site, you want to get a mobile sitemap. So another thing you got to do with your website is set up a sitemap. Now we've already set up four sitemaps. We set up an HTML sitemap, an XML sitemap, an image sitemap, and a video sitemap. So now we're going to go set up a mobile sitemap. And then they want you to submit it to the webmaster tool so it can be tracked. And then they also want you to go and verify that certain parts of the code that is set up for mobile, that is your user agent code, is uh, has got Googlebot Mobile included so that it, they, the Google Mobile uh, robot will be allowed into your mobile website. And uh, they want to make sure that it's using a certain format of HTML, basically XHTML or compact HTML. Um, for mobile sites. So there are three things it wants you to do. What we're going to do in this video is part one. Uh, that is, let's go set up a mobile sitemap. So for that, we'll go into the dashboard. Here we are at, at uh, wptrainersite.info. And we're going to go to our, down here to the sidebar, plugins. And then we're going to go add new. And then we're going to go with mobile oops sitemap we'll see what comes up and google xml sitemap for mobile i mean argwal that's the guy we used last time so we're going to click install so that's the one we're going to use we're going to click install we're going to activate it we're going to go down and see where it is. There is a Google Mobile sitemap. And uh, we are going to, for mobile, let's go to the settings page right here. It's just as easy to find it here. So we're going to come over to settings page. And we're going to come over here and generate a Google Mobile sitemap. Sitemap file. So there is the sitemap. We verified it's created it. And remember what we did in the other videos, we want to take this extension, sitemap-mobile.xml. I'm going to copy it to my notepad. And then we are going to go to the webmaster tool. Oops. We got to uh, sign in. 
So here's the Google Webmaster tool. We saw this in another video. We are going to select website trainer.info. I'm going to come down here to the sitemaps. There on the right bottom side is the sitemap area. I'm going to click more. I'm now in the sitemap dashboard. I want to submit a sitemap and I'm going to add the sitemap mobile extension. I'm going to submit and it's going to take a little while for it to go track it, etc. But we're done. So there we are. So we have to come back to uh, what we were talking about here. We are setting up uh, our websites to be mobile friendly. And the first part of the uh, process was to get a mobile sitemap set up. And that's exactly what we did. In the next video, we're going to go and find a mobile plugin. And that will take care of, of, of the process two and three because those plugins will automatically come in with user agent uh, set up for Google Mobile and uh, with the proper uh, HTML format. So that's it. I hope this has been helpful. This is Claude Pilon at Affiliate Starting Line. Stay with it, stay well, and we'll talk to you soon.